All right, let's practice reducing fractions to lowest terms. When we do lowest terms, that means I cannot simplify the fraction anymore. So if I have six eighths and I want to put it into lowest terms, I need to find what number can go into both six and eight. I know that two can go into both six and eight because they're both even numbers. So what is six divided by two? That's three. And what's eight divided by two? Four. So three fourths is my answer. Next one, write nine twelfths in lowest terms. Okay, well, I know nine isn't even, so I know that two won't work, but I know three works. So we're gonna try three. What's nine divided by three? Or think three times what equals nine? Three. And what's 12 divided by three? Four. So this is nine twelfths in lowest terms, three fourths. Next one, six twelfths into lowest terms. Now, I love this one, okay? I already know that six is half of 12. I already gave you the simplified answer, the lowest terms, because six divided by six is one and 12 divided by six is two, one half. Next one, two eighths. So I have two and I have eight. Well, I can't divide by one because if I divide by one, I'm just gonna keep getting two eighths. So that means my other choice is to divide by two, which is what I'm going to do. So what is two divided by two? Or think two times what equals two? One. And eight divided by two equals four. So two eighths in lowest terms is one fourth. Next, six twelfths in lowest terms. What did I tell you about six and 12? Six is what of 12? It is half of 12, one half. Next one, there's another one that this works for, two fourths. Two is one half of four. Two divided by two is one, and four divided by two is two. Two fourths, two is half of four. Next one, write three twelfths in lowest terms. Okay, well, I can't divide by one because I would just keep getting three twelfths over and over. So that means my only other option is three because the only two factors for three are one and three. So three divided by three is one, and 12 divided by three equals four. So three twelfths in lowest terms is one fourth. Okay, we have three sixths. Guess what? Is three half of six? Yes, it is. 3 divided by 3 equals 1, and 6 divided by 3 equals 2. 1 half. Next one, 3 ninths. Well, the only two factors for 3 are 1 and 3, and we know we can't use 1. So we're going to use 3. So what is Three divided by three, one. What is nine divided by three? Or think three times what equals nine? Three. So three-ninths in lowest terms 
is one third. Let's try one more. Two sixths in lowest terms. Well, two only has two factors, one and two. So we're going to use two. Two divided by two equals one, and six divided by two equals three. So two sixths in lowest terms is one third. Way to reduce those fractions.